Hi, back again to the next part of a Blender tutorial to build a car. Today uh, we make the mesh and then we cut out this part. Okay, so let's start. Uh, we make it all with a uh, cube. So we scale them in the set. I'll make your screencast keys on. So in the X, I bring it to this size. Um, we will all tweak that later uh, completely, uh, but for a moment it's uh, good enough. So, so we go in edit mode and um, give here a loop in and delete the rest for that this must be on so you can see all points birds we delete them so we can use a mirror there because when you must do it with a mirror when you haven't one you make here something a little bit deeper they are a little bit higher and the whole car looks shit so better is to make it so good uh, we make clipping on that means it uh, merges together in the mill where they hit okay then we need a um, subdivision surface it makes the car round but at first with this eye you can make this active or not active so, at first, uh, we go there and get this top face and extrude them out to this point here. Go to point selection, take that on. Circle with C, circle selection, and move that here. Why it looks so wired? I don't know. Okay. Um, then we get this part here. And my little back. Such like that. Then we go there and get this part here out. So extrude go to chop and scale that in the x so that we get this points there that they line up with the car mesh so here one and here one okay uh, that we make with the uh, scale set zero, that it, it's correctly line up. Yes, good. Let me look here. Uh, maybe down a little bit deeper. Let me see later. Okay. Um, so we get down with the rest. Extrude to the bottom of this. Scale it in the y uh, in the x. So, so um, we don't see through that car. So we can make that with this here is the data of the object, and there you can say uh, how you should be looking. So when we go here to wireframe, we can see our wire and see the car between them. That is fine for us to work with. So here we go a little bit more there, here yeah, a little bit there, and then we go up. So we select that, go a little higher, such like that. Wonderful. Um, you see that is how it looks in real in the moment. Uh, now we go here and make a solid again. That is our current moment. But when we apply, uh, when we activate the 
modifier we will see oh something happens yeah can be a car but a bad bad car so we must tweak that that it looks good so how we do that it's simple um, we make that with loops with the loops we can sharpen this roundness here so that means when I make a loop in there I can say how should that sharpen and when I make a loop here you can see how the car goes sharper in that lines so uh, now we go to smooth so that looks a little better uh, now you see here is not sharp enough and here isn't sharp enough so we need a loop here and to say where's the top here and to say that should be straight we loop in there and one there and this should be round so that is correct uh, now it looks like that that is the basic shape from the side we look to our wire mode and we see it lines up not completely but nearly good here we have a problem and here with a high um, so we go to solid mode and we see we need here some higher so we cut in the loop and uh, scale x0 to make it completely straight and then we get this point and tweak them up so it line up with the rest here the same a little line up okay here we must sharpen that that means we go down here with a loop and we can go up from here if you like we can try it so when we now look to this wire mode you see it line up more and more correctly it's a little here but we can go up uh, so I take this part here and tweak them up so that fits now from the side from the side view we have uh, the car but you see it is too bright here and such other things but for this is good now we make a copy of that with shift D and rotate that in the set axis 90 degrees and now we can see it from the front now we make the same we tweak our points to li line up with this uh, roundness there you see also that is a little too fat there that all we must clear so we make the same wire mode uh, for this moment I will make it such like that uh, we mark that here uh, we must make it softly here it lines up okay and then we get this part here it lines up and we get that part here and this part here to the outline and this here too um, you must concentrate on one side you can't make it in both sides correctly that is uh, not possible that is the mirror and uh, we work here on this side and so we only tweak this things here to be good so that is good for there then a little bit in here a little bit out 
there. Wonderful. Wonderful. So we look down here. What is there? Are we line up there? Oh, mostly. Okay. Yeah, looks much better. But we have a little streaks there and here. That comes um, because we sharpen that uh, too much in this lines here, because that is a flat area, and we don't need um, to um, flatten them mid with a loop. Here in the front, it's okay to tweak how round should it be, but not on the sides. So uh, we can uh, delete them. So that means we can. Uh, get the whole line and make it, or make uh, only this. So with the X, dissolve edges, we can get them out. And same as here, dissolve edges. And you see it's round without straight. Here's the only one. And there we must do the same. We get them out. And then we see that is the lineup where the the, uh, the windows later come in. Yeah, uh, you can surely get them out too, and more and more and more. Um, but uh, any time is uh, finished there, and then it's better. Uh, it lines up there correctly. Yeah. So that is good. Now from the front and from the side, um, what we must do is. Uh, we must look from the top uh, where is this point is that correctly or not correct so shift D to make a duplicate of them rotate set minus 90 degrees and then rotate in the x-axis 90 degrees and then we have a top view from the car and we see it line up good and now we need to go in the wire mode and we go back to solid mode and look where we get our windows here this lines up this lines up the space between is the same um, but we will make one side that is this side here more line up with the whole uh, lines here so we get that and we can tweak them out just a little don't do too much too much can destroy this uh, whole work so be careful with that We go here a little bit out. Yes. That is good for now. Okay. Oh. So that view. And wire again. Wire out is okay. Set. Okay. Uh, in solid mode, yeah. Good. We have it so long here. Go down, here goes down. That lines up. That lines up too. That is good. In the middle, we must read that is um, straight in the moment. We need a little light uh, roundness there. Uh, so we do that. We go back here to material mode. And then we can give them a little roundness here. That means we take this part here and give them a little coming out part. And um, you see here something happened. That means it wasn't uh, correctly merged together. So we make it now. Mark that and mark the uh, goal word and then merge at last so that fixed together now and it's correctly light up okay 
Um, so you see that it is not as round as it should. That means we make here a little roundness too. And we see much rounder than before, but here is a problem too, I think, and there too. Where this whole shit come? Oh, it's not correctly fixed together. So we have here one that isn't, yeah. So we make the same, mark that, mark that, and merge it last. And I think here's the same, yeah. Select that, select the other point, and then merge to last. That is okay. Then we have here this part, merge them together to last. Okay. So we have that for now. Later we must look. I think here are problems in, yeah. So we merge them to last. We see here's the same. So merge them together to last, at last. Okay. You can see when the word is okay, when in all directions it is um, yellow. That means it is one point. When you have a point where it isn't in one direction yellow, then it is not fixed together to this side. So you must merge them then there. Okay. So we get now this part here from the top view there and give them a little and make here another two. So we give them a little more roundness there. And maybe a little there. And then that you have here around stuff. Not must be 100%, but nearly, yeah, you know what I mean. Good. Now we have that um, base mesh. That is correctly for now. Go to front view and check. All is correct. Uh, we see the roundness here. That is okay. Uh, the car is a little round at the front and a little on the front part of the window. So we must tweak that. So that means we can get this part here and make it a little bit out. And this part here a little, and this part too. So we have around stair two. That's good for now. Yes, around, and we need it at the front too. So we mark that here, get a little bit out. This point's a little more, and here. And we have a roundness. That's not too much, not too less. That's good. Uh, we see at the uh, back side there is two, but only a little. So don't make too much. Only be careful. So that, that is enough. Good. We have now our base mesh. In our next tutorial uh, part, we will cut out uh, the windows and that stuff. Uh, this window, this window, um, the, the holes for the wheels. And um, then we can uh, go on with it all. So, that was it for this part. See you in the next part. Bye.